Hi guys, five things that matters for your resume so that your resume gets shortlisted for your companies. So first and foremost, start with a position driven resume. So we are not looking out for someone which is having a lot of paragraphs written or biography written or like career objectives written. No, those are all are trash. Don't put all those biography things. Just put in one liner, who are you? and what all experience you have gained and what all projects you have built with what all tech stacks just in one to two line that is enough for pressures but if you are experienced like above two or three years experience then that line is also not required directly you can start with work experience and skill section second thing is your first 10 seconds is very much crucial what you are writing the recruiters are not actually reading they are skimming through your resumes because they don't have that much time to go through entire thing so the first few sections or so headlines, your top heading, which, is, which should contain LinkedIn profile, GitHub projects. So those all things or you have created some standard major project you have created with respect to any application, big application, so that you can put it over there. So try to put work experience first, then skills and then education and then achievement or education in total depends upon you. So this is a thing. So first. 10 lines are very important what you have put third thing is bullet point must be measurable so you should not do any kind of storytelling like in a big paragraph you should not do any kind of storytelling rather you should have a bullet point with some measurable metrics so whatever bullet points you are writing add it with a certain metrics for example like developed an e-commerce application and delivered to the client three days before the, the timelines as uh, as given by the client and and reduce the api response time by 25 percent so like that you can provide so there should be some quantifying metrics at each bullet points and all bullet points needs to be connected with each other and uh, the main thing is you should add your tech stacks with your expertise and along with that end it with the value impact then show some real skills or don't put anything try to see like what is the actual requirement try to check the roles and responsibility for the job after that only you put it okay. otherwise don't put it always and always try to see like what is the roles and responsibility for that job and take the keywords you can make use of chat gpt also take the keywords and then put it in your resume and fifth very important is your resume should be ATS formatted. Okay. So stop making it fancy, rather try to make it ATS compliant. So there are few things that I should tell you like there should not be any tables, there should not be any photo, there should not be any logos and there are a lot of things that we should understand. Okay. So if you want to know more, just a book one to one session with me so that I can review your resume and I can tell you like what is your score currently, ATS score and, and what's the probability of getting more and more recruiter calls.